Hi everyone, it's Marva Riley again, and I am in my backyard in my garden. And this is one of the new vegetables that I planted this year is okra. It's my first year planting okra. I didn't even know that this is how okras are planted. This is how they grow. Okay, on this little, I guess you could call it a little tree. <laughs> Look how beautiful they are. Truly organic okra. And another thing that I didn't know is that they blossom. This is an okra blossom. And it, they actually have a beautiful yellow flower. And uh, it's the end of the day. So what I find is that they fold at the end of the day. During the daytime, they're open wide and beautiful. And at the end of the day, they fold and they the blossoms fall off. And then next day, I see the okra vegetable uh, coming up. So... And this one actually might be ready for me to reap. <laughs> now, okra, I grew up on okra. I'm from the island of Jamaica, and okra was a common, commonly eaten vegetable in my little island. And um, it was often uh, cooked with meats, um, sautéed or steamed. Uh, by itself and eaten and I remember the uh, my grandmother used to tell well when I was pregnant actually she would say that if I ate okra during my pregnancy then my uh, childbirth experience would be shorter and quicker it would give me what they call quick foot <laughs> that mean uh, my labor would not be long so I did eat okra quite a bit when I was pregnant. I'm not sure that it helped because, um, you know, both of my kids, I labored for a long time. But okra has so many great nutrients, vitamin C, vitamin A, B vitamins, folate, and uh, so many other nutrients that I can't even remember right now. And I have a Facebook group called the doctor in you and recently someone posted a beautiful video about the many health benefits of okra and one of them was that it increases the libido yes you heard me <laughs> and uh, the okra tea they said increases the libido which i'm really not surprised about because it it is such a nutritious plant um so yes i planted okra actually next season i'm going to plant a lot more because they're so easy to grow and very very hardy so uh these are almost ready to reap and uh, i probably will use these to make tea uh, they said uh, if you use the okra to make tea, uh, it'll increase the libido. And we can all do with a little help in that area, especially <laughs> later on in life when you get to menopause and stuff like that. So yeah, this is okra. Recently, I went to the store, the supermarket, and sought out okra. And it was actually quite inexpensive. A whole pack of okra was less than $2.00. And I added them to my sautéed vegetable and what a delightful flavor and taste it added. So this is okra. This is the okra plant that I planted in my backyard. Look how beautiful those leaves are. Yeah, you can plant these things in pots, even if you live in apartments. You can plant these things in pots because they're not big. And eat some of what you grow. Thank you for joining me today and take care now. This is Marva Riley.